Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we will discuss about uh, some practice example on nested loops. In our last class, we already discussed the execution flow of nested loops. Please watch that class and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, uh, so our uh, what we need to display here is we need to display 10 tables, 2 to 10 tables means uh, See, 2 table means 2 multiplied by 1 equal to 2, 2 multiplied by 2 equal to 4. This is 2 table. Like that, we need to display up to 10 tables. Each table should be displayed up to 10. 2 multiplied by 10 equal to 20. Like that, 3rd table, 4th table, 5th table, 6th table, 7th table, 8th, 9th and 10th table. This is the output you need to display. So, even though it is a simple example, you need to understand how, how you have to put this real-time need into the code that is the point you need to understand so your focus should be on that uh, how this is converted into coding that is what where you need to focus so with this simple examples if you focus on how to write the code writing complex examples will be easy which we discuss in our coming classes and we do in our multiple assignments in our next coming assignments and the practice tests so coming here See here, the logic goes like this. You need to understand this. 2 multiplied by 1, 2. 2 multiplied by 2, 4. 2 multiplied by 3, 6, so on. 10 times. You need to repeat a code 10 times. So this is the point we discussed when we discussed loops in our previous class. If you want to execute a code multiple times, we need a loop. Similarly, we need to do the same thing multiple times. So, we need a loop for this. In order to display a table, we need a loop. Similarly, we need to display like this 10 tables. So, we need an extra loop. That is where it comes from nested loop. So, keep this in, in your mind. Then, if you understand the code, you will understand how to write the coding easily. So, see here, come. So, for i is equal to 2, i less than or equal to 10, i plus plus, open brackets, closed brackets. This is where the body of the external loop, outer loop. Inside this, we have written one more loop. For, I, for j is equal to 1, j less than or equal to 10, j plus plus. So, how it is going to be executed? This discussion made in our last class. I is equal to 2, this is going to be executed for 10 times. I is equal to 3, this is going to be executed for 10 times. I is equal to 4, 10 times. Each time it has to display multiples of 2, multiples of 3, multiples of 4. See here, what's changing here? For I is equal to 2, it is executing for 10 times. So use this to display 2 table. For I is equal to 3, this j is going to be executed for 10 times. Use this because now i value is 3. Use this to display the third table. How we are going to use this? Use this variable inside the loop. If you understand this point, which variable I can use? Writing the code is very very easy. See here. For j is equal to 1, j less than or equal to 10, j plus plus. What we are going to display here? I, I I means initially first time i is equal to 2, 2 multiplied by j means first time 1, second time 2, third time 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. i is not changing for this 10 loops, i is same, the value is 2. So 2 multiplied by 1 is equal to, so you need to display the answer, that's why 2 multiplied by 1, 2 multiplied by 2, 2 multiplied by 3. This is how we are going to display the table, two table. After coming out of this loop, we are giving one empty space and again now i will become 3. We are using this i here. 3 multiplied by 1, 3 multiplied by 2, 3 multiplied by 3. So that uh, we are using this i variable to display the tables. So you have to concentrate here because this is the first class we are explaining too much on the loops concept. Uh, so, as classes are going on, we will go very fast. So, hope you understand. If you are if you are not good at uh, this understanding, once again listen to this video and try to execute this and try to understand this example. 
hope you understand this example if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you